Hey guys, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. My name is Jaser. Welcome to the channel, or welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be checking out a demo for a dinosaur survival horror game that's called Tempest Triad. Now, I actually had no idea this game existed, and I saw quick little gameplay on it on youtube and i was like i definitely have to try this out because if you guys can see i am a big jurassic park fan definitely my favorite franchise ever so when it comes to a horror game and dinosaurs you definitely can mix them up and make a pretty cool game so yeah i've actually been saying that we're kind of in a drought when it comes to dinosaur survival horror games but little by little we're actually starting to see more and more i actually played a demo not that long ago for another one that's pretty interesting that's called unknown tapes if you guys want to check that one out i have a link down below in the description if you guys want to go check that one out after this one but yeah this one is being solo developed which when it comes to developers solo developing a game it is very challenging and to make a dinosaur game i think has its own challenges so yeah hopefully this doesn't feel very generic so yeah we're gonna take a look and see what we think about it for ourselves if you guys like these type of videos make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and let's see what we get ourselves into shall we all right guys we're jumping in tempest triad let's do it let's do it like i said a dinosaur survival horror game sign me up man sign me up let's see what we get ourselves into with this one okay damn man we're right we're rolling on a nice whip right here look at this thing right here sheesh Yup, I was about to say, that looks like a Mercedes. <laughs> okay. We rolling, we rolling hot. All right, it's pretty foggy over here, man. Can we run? Yes, we can. Cool. I need to go underground and perform the final test. Just one more time and this will end. So no voice acting. Just this, and I'll be back to you, my daughter. All right. Everything's handy dandy for now. Until we hear the screams. All right. Over here. Nothing to interact with got tanks and all that current task ask a soldier to remove the vehicle from the road hmm can't fit through there okay all right so we got a map here gas treatment parking basement entrance and a lake container so we're right here hmm all right got a jack go look around very quiet man very quiet oh there's a gate open here cool all right got some heavy breathing characters seems to be catching her breath i think it sounds like a female could be wrong. All right. A lot of military stuff here. Damn. All right, dead end. So we got to find the soldier. Can we actually crouch? Control, great. Yeah, but we can't go that way. All right, might be a dead end here then. There we go. Let's go this way. Whoa! Go underground. So is this the one that we got asked to move? Not yet. I mean, so far from the presentation, I feel like, oh, they're already here. They'll probably take the second capsule to another base. I only have one more chance now. All 
All right. Very quiet. Not even like some ambient, subtle, spooky type of background music to go with it. Hmm. Oh, this thing's not here no more. All right. The light at the end of the tunnel, is it freedom or just an oncoming train? Oncoming train. Let's go see. Yeah, it feels like a very like... Whoa. Current test, activate the elevator. Right? Yeah, it definitely feels like an early build of the demo, so... That's why I always say, like, I'm very optimistic with these games and it's being solo developed, so. You always just got to hope for the best, right? Whoa. I did go all the way down. Did I mess up and not going in first? There it is. All right, we're in. How do we activate to go down? Here we go. Boom. Very... Huh. Interesting. Yeah, there's not much, like... Sound design to the environments either. So, yeah, it's very, like, early build of the demo. So I would assume this game's gonna be somewhat ways off before it officially releases. Man, it's very, very dark in here. Very spooky. Where is everyone? Damn it. It doesn't matter now. Just get it done. All right. Another elevator over there. Thing on this side. Everything's quiet so far. I just go this way. Hmm. What we got here. Current task, grab the capsule and turn on the machine. All right. There it is. This machine? Please, one last time. Are we going to get, like, scanned? And it's over. Scan completed. All right, let's see. What a terrible headache. Did it work? That is the question, huh? The capsule is gone, but I only used it once. Is this where this is where things probably start getting a little more horrific return to the surface all right wasn't this way nope flashlight would be very handy we go through this way yeah right All right. So far, so good. I mean, 
it has creepy creepy atmosphere but i definitely do think that some spooky environment ambient music should be played in the background just to add more to the atmosphere you know it's very like quiet current task find a general to learn what happened oh shit not a good sign not a good sign when you hear that let's go see what's cracking over here whoa no way you just see that flying over our heads damn and this spooky foggy night current task he's probably in the helicopter all right let's go this way since we know the helicopter is on this side Was that gunshots what the hell is happening here oh no damn it they're all they're gone damn they left us what the hell is that Anybody there? Hello? I didn't sound... I didn't sound human. Oh! Chopper's going down! Bam! Oh. Someone please tell me what's going on. Has the base been discovered? So are they kind of like... I need to get to the helicopter. So is this game kind of, you know, taking some inspiration? From like, obviously Jurassic Park. Little base. Instead of them building a theme park, they got like a little experimental base and the dinosaurs escaped. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, hey. Hey, 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 hey. I said easy. Anybody here? Yo. Nope, just noise. Go behind the base to find the helicopter. All right. Is there a entrance somewhere here? Doesn't seem like it. Maybe this way then. Got some fireflies. Here we go. I can crouch and squeeze through here. Of course we can. Let's do it. Shh. Crap. All right. Let's find this helicopter. We're starting to hear things around us. Anything this way? <laughs> the hell is that? Alright, it's definitely not this way. That's one thing that I kind of do notice when it comes to, like, dinosaur games. Like, I don't know, like, when it comes to, like, the sound design of them. I don't know, we're just spoiled when it comes to, like, Jurassic Park. But I don't know. So they don't really land when it comes to like like indie developers making like we played a horror. Uh, we tried out fossil fuel. I don't know if you guys ever tried that dinosaur like shooter. But I don't know something about oh crap about like those dinosaur sound designs didn't really land for me. Oh crap! Find a way to get past the creatures. <laughs> Just like that, all the creatures, compies, huh? Did they see me? Hope not. 
The game is just kind of just like throwing us in here, huh? We got compies, man. Crap. All right. We go. Oh, damn. Run. Run. Get away. Get away. Oh, my God. It's right behind us. We can outrun a compy. We can outrun a compy. Oh, there's a couple of them. There's a couple of them. Of course. Go. Go. Jump. There we go. Whew. What are those things? Dinosaurs? They exist? And how the hell are they alive? Oh, yep. There it is. All right, so we survived the compies, man. All right. Let's see what else. Let's see what else is out here, man. Oh. Crap. That ain't a good sign. Go this way. Go through the containers until you can find a clue about the helicopter. Let's do it. Dead end? Dead end. Right? Maybe this right side? So yeah, there's very minimal to no HUD actually. So uh, I guess to keep the game very focused on the environments and the game. Oh. What the? F what the hell is that? How did that come from? Uh oh. We're being hunted. Find a way to get past the container. Alright. Here we go. See what this does. Oh, lift it up. Noise. Alright. That's enough to get through. Just make it quick. Don't want to get squished. Everything's handy dandy, man. I guess until the freaking raptors show up or something. I don't know what kind of variety of dinosaurs they're going to have in this one. Oh, shit. What the hell? Okay, is it just... That's that one dinosaur that... I forgot the name of it, but it's the dinosaur that they introduced in Jurassic World Dominion, which it's a cool dinosaur, but I think the Spinosaurus should have been the one that took this one's place. Gotta be honest, man. Gotta be honest. It is a cool dinosaur. Don't get me wrong. But for Jurassic World Dominion, I think it should have been the Spinosaurus instead of this one. But I don't know what's going on here. It kind of froze there or... Oh, we're dead. <laughs> right, let's try this again. Oh, shit. It's just speaking, man. So, yeah, the game definitely still needs work, man. It's just uh, getting frozen, right? Oh, okay. I'm sorry I said that. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. <laughs> Oh shit, turn the switch and look for the gate. Is he so hot me?
So I really got to keep my eye on them? I don't think oh, that's how that... I don't think that's how a dinosaur works. Right? And now it didn't stop. Stay there. All right. Is it back over there? Stay right there. Stay right there. Has to be something over here, man. Stay right there. Stay right there. Ooh. All right. Go, 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 go. Nope. Did end, did end, did end, did end, did end. Back this way. There it is. Go, go, go. Oh, we made it. We made it out. Cool. Oof. A lake. All right. So hopefully they don't have any. Oh. Yeah. Okay. What the hell was that? What the hell was that? Are right, you hear gunshots? The helicopter should be around here. But I have a bad feeling about the this forest. Yeah, me too, man. What the hell? I need to get out of here as fast as possible. Oh, shit. Search for the helicopter. Oh, look at this big old... Rib cage right here, man. Definitely don't want to be here. Oh, man. Let's keep going. Let's keep pushing. Let's see where we end off. Come on, character. Put your stamina back. Can't stay out here. Oh. Let's go, let's go. The hell? Damn freaking bird. Where the hell am I going, man? Kind of lost here, man. I'm gonna lie. Where am I going? It'd be cool if we had like some kind of map, a radar, something, compass to to guide us through this freaking forest. Yeah, as we get stuck here. Oh, can't see the helicopter. Damn. I'm looking too good. Ooh. Wow. 
why why are these things happening damn it did this place go back in time or did these creatures come to the present hmm i only have one capsule left damn home wouldn't make it this has to work i need to fix all of this It will. It has to work. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. Oh, crap. Oh, of course. That's where it's going to end. Huh? Tempest Triad. Woo, thanks for playing. And please add the game to your Steam wish list. It helps me a lot. There it is, guys. That is the demo for Tempest Triad. Now, I gotta say, the game definitely has a lot of potential, but I do feel like this demo is an early build of the game. At least I hope so, because there's definitely a lot of things that the game needs. For one, I feel like having some ambient, you know, spooky music to go with the gameplay in the background is definitely needed i feel like just walking around and everything just being flat you hear nothing but your little subtle footsteps and your character breathing kind of kind of takes away from the game not gonna lie unless like you're gonna about to enter like a very you know spooky scenario then i understand but when you're actually playing through the game i think that definitely has to be there having more sound design and more things like you know interacting with the elevator and walking around touching doors or whatever the case may be just having more of a sound design to the game because it kind of kind of did feel flat and i would say also the dinosaurs animations the ai definitely needs some improvement i will say another part that i didn't really like at least i do like it when it comes to other horror games but with this one it kind of doesn't make sense with the big dinosaur with the long claws i forget the name of it but having to keep your eyes on the dinosaur so it doesn't actually kill you or chase you kind of threw me off because it makes sense for all the horror games whether you're keeping your eyes on like a mannequin or something like that but on a, a dinosaur yeah you better just run and hope it doesn't get you because that's how a dinosaur would you know typically work i don't think if you just keep your eyes on the dinosaur it's just gonna stay still for you to you know make your escape so that kind of did throw me off i would just rather have you sneak around trying to avoid the dinosaur or something like a alien isolation type of thing just hide and not get seen so i would say that can definitely be improved upon it like i said it does work for other horror games but for a dinosaur game having to just keep your eye on a dinosaur for it not to chase you or move kind of doesn't make sense but that's just me so that's just some feedback to the developer i don't know if that's just like a placeholder thing just for the demo but hopefully when the full game does come along that's definitely improved upon but yeah like i said the game has a lot of potential so we'll see how it actually comes out in the end so if you guys want to check it out guys tempest triad on steam try the demo for yourselves if you guys want if not make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe to the channel because i definitely most likely will be playing this game when it fully launches i do have it on my wish list so we'll see when that comes but yeah guys hope you guys enjoyed again make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already and i'll catch you guys on the next one take care peace